just to let you know i am not coming back to the game because it's too toxic and there's too much new gens She hella bad. I'ma hit it one shot, I won't hit it back. Do the dash, new Balenciaga got a bag, hit it back. Pedal to the gas, shotty, I've been living fast. La la, she hella bad. I'ma hit it one shot, I won't hit it back. Do the dash, new Balenciaga got a bag, hit it back. Pedal to the gas, shotty, I've been living fast. Hey, what you mean? What you want? What we doing? Pull up with a coupe, no roof, just to do it. She only talk cash 'cause she know I speak fluent. The devil in the dress, shotty, I can see through it. She know I'm a rock star. Yeah, they're asking how I do this Right up in a whip, yeah, I hit it, now I'm moving Speaking my own language, yeah, the 
The story of me starts in March 24, 2019, the day I started playing SW. Glitchy showed me the game and it looked interesting. I was pretty unknown to the community at first because I never knew it existed. <clears throat> I eventually see a video of Dom and it made me want to keep playing so I could meet him, which by the way, I never met him. I made a new friend named King Lurk because we were fans of Dom and some other guys as well. Eventually, I was attacked by someone who was wearing the v Magius outfit, which is when I would eventually discover the community. I would learn about the SW gods there like v Magius and Kla. Glitchy decided to train me before I would join the SW community because he's a really good player and eventually on June 2, 2020, I joined SW I joined the SW community. I would PvP pros and bully noobs and I was starting to become toxic. And on January 3, 2021 was when I met Sky Kanid and EMX Alegria that would become my SW best friend. On January 31st, 2021 was when I posted my first video on this channel. I was nervous that people would see me like Efi. And if you don't know what I mean by that, I mean hate it. But luckily, I wasn't. Then I decided that I wanted to become the best player, which was never achieved. In fact, I don't. I didn't even have high hopes for it, to be honest. But hopefully, best player of Asia, though. So I decided to target SW Gods, mainly Mind, because I used to be a fan of him. <coughs> <coughs> Then, I then met who steal my email, aka Sadman. We decided to PvP and I'm pretty sure y'all saw the video of me PvPing him. And when I did the comeback but died, what he, sa what he, ma what he said made me really happy. So I added him and Klana who would later betray me and made me more toxic. I also fought Dark Life but... I then got coned to add me. And the best thing that ever happened to me was when Mind and Efi embarrassingly died to me. And I would fight Rajir back when he was decent and Apples as well. They're really good now. I saw their videos. I remember joining Bear Gang and betrayed them for DS Clan because Andy Candy Show didn't forgive me, which made me not regret betraying them. I would then beat Nebulax, 11k Souls, Solary, and Beast Jeff on mobile and more. I also got trained a little bit by Angry Birds. I would then 2v2 people. I forgot who they were supposed to be, but it was against they were against me and Jordan Hostin, and I can't believe I gone so far in the community from March 2019 through May 2021. Me and EMX had our last 1v1. I don't remember the score, but he was a really good non-auto. And the DS Bear conflict was probably the biggest event that happened in my journey. Although I wish there was another Vietnamese person that played SW to comfort me since I felt lonely being the probably only recognized Vietnamese player in SW. It was nice knowing everyone in the community, even XVQCC, because he made me want to continue playing aggressively. I never forget I will never forget you all and what I had accomplished during the times I played the game. If I had one thing I could time travel to, it would be reliving my SW journey because of good memories. Stay safe and don't let the toxic people get to you.